scooter enthusiasts are descending on Hawke's Bay for the sport's biggest ever event in the region. The New Zealand Scooter Nationals will be held at Napier's Bay Skate this Saturday, with more than 100 riders and 800 spectators expected. This is a professional sport. Uh, it is for the Australasian Scooter Association New Zealand Nationals. Um, riders that qualify here get to go to Australia and compete. Freestyle scootering is one of the world's fastest growing extreme sports with plenty of locals competitive in their divisions. Brian Pedlow is a star to keep an eye out for. Alexandra Madsen, who's currently world number two, is going to be there. Quinn Heath Morrell, who's doing his first New Zealand Nationals, we believe is going to come first. So yeah, there's quite a few locals actually. Those are just a few off the top of my head. Spectators will fill a stadium originally built for performing seals and dolphins at the Napier City Council site, formerly Marine Land. New ramps have been built, sporting a proprietary surface from Australia. They match the scale of the stadium, appropriate for this growing sport. And scooters is, to me, as popular, if not more popular than rugby. Uh, rugby, you, you train hard, no disrespect towards rugby players, but you train really hard. You train for an hour, maybe two a session. Scooters, you're riding uh, six, seven, eight hours a day. Sometimes you, you're part of a community here, you're not judged against the team, it's just you and your own ability to progress in your own way possible. I can't thank the Quest enough for, for sponsoring the accommodation and the City Council for ultimately funding it all for us. One Bay Skate employee is setting her hopes high with the competition offering a golden ticket of direct qualification to the World Roller Games. Uh, yeah, we've got a few professional riders from Auckland, Connor Ransley. I've met him a few times, but he's going to be killing it out there, so I'm super excited to, to be uh, amongst it. Uh, I placed second at Worlds in 2019, so I'm hoping to take that top spot this year. Tickets for the Saturday event are just $6 online and $10 at the door. Patrick O'Sullivan, Local Focus. Thank you.